but I'm also extremely charming, so. Originally from Hamilton, Canada, and now living in London, England. He's a very, very funny guy. Give it up for Jason Rouse, everybody. Woo! Yeah. I didn't always used to look like this. Before I moved to England, I was a 12-year-old girl with a dream. <laughs> Fucking London has changed me, but it's really nice being back in Canada in front of girls with uh, teeth. Fucking big deal for me. I love you fucking Montreal girls. I love girls from Montreal. You know why I love you girls? Because one girl from Montreal could out drink a small Canadian village. <laughs> yeah. Woo! You bitches are crazy. I love watching the way the club on the weekends. It's beautiful. Oh, it's like the gates of heaven open up. Little angels coming down the street. Oh, Then you get in the club, you have about 50, 60, 100 shooters, and you change a little bit by the end of the night. After last call, that door swings open. It's a different story. <laughs> ah! 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 <laughs> <laughs> Fuck me! Fuck me! <laughs> and I'm always like, <laughs> okay. As soon as you're done having a shit, we're gonna make love. <laughs> you got some french fries on your chin, kitten? <gasps> meow, meow, meow! Meow, meow, meow! <laughs> look at these little girls. How old are you, sweetheart? You look like you're nine. <laughs> She's just sitting there for Christmas. I want my period. Ah. <laughs> uh. Don't get me started, they are delicious. <laughs> Look at you, you're so hot, I'd actually fuck that guy to get to you. <laughs> Who's the faggot now? <laughs> Don't worry, fellow, I'll put a wig on your ass so it looks like you're blowing me. <laughs> Madam. Look, your girlfriend's covering her mouth, she knows where it goes. <laughs> yeah. I'll fuck her in the mouth. If I come in your girlfriend's mouth, it's gonna look like an open tin of mushroom soup. I mean, would you like to see a movie? Oh yeah, you guys better get into this, because at the end of the show, I put my fist in my ass and sing I'm a little teapot. Yeah, it's Montreal. Do it in French, we'll give you a government grant. Bonjour. I do like living in England. Uh, because you can say cunt there. It's more of a greeting for those people, huh? <laughs> ah, you're a fucking cunt, mate. <laughs> Stop it, officer. <laughs> you can't really say cunt in Canada. I've tried. Can you say cunt, sweetheart? Cunt. Yeah, you did say it, and you're so much prettier now. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm going to take you out in the woods, and fuck, they're never going to find your body. Classy. Yeah, you are an exception to the rule. Most girls fucking lose their shit when they hear that word, huh? Cunt. <laughs> it is not a cunt. <laughs> this is a beautiful flower. <laughs> and I'm always like, no, it's not. You might want to put a mirror under that thing. <laughs> yeah, I think you need to take a closer look, sweetheart. Looks like someone's fired a gun off inside of you. <laughs> Don't be ashamed of your cunts, ladies. They're delicious. I could eat a whole box to myself. <laughs> oh, and I've eaten some nasty vagina in my day. The old guy in the corner knows what I'm talking about, eh? <laughs> uh, you remember the 70s, don't you, sir? Pulled down your underwear, it looked like somebody shit in a hairbrush, didn't it? <laughs> yeah. Fucking big old hairy monster looking at you. <laughs> we meet again, Chewy. <laughs> I'd be afraid of you, but you got no teeth. <laughs> and your gums are bleeding. <laughs> I'm not the only member of the 28 Days Later. <laughs> Come on, who's got their red wings? I love a good heavy day. 
go to the door, Jehovah's Witnesses are standing there. <laughs> There's been a horrible accident! Ah! 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 <laughs> Just kidding, it's pussy. <laughs> oh, long live Jesus. You're not laughing, you're just like, when's he gonna do a joke about a puppy? <laughs> Let's fuck the puppy. No, no, what I'm trying to say is stay in school. This isn't really a comedy show anymore, it's more of a hostage situation, isn't it? Invisible, that would look fucking cool. <laughs> you win this round, Kate Moss. You win this round. It's how I like my girls, tall and thin, with a tight ass, no arms, and an open mouth. <laughs> Shh. Not now, Daddy's working. Actually, I was getting a blowjob the other night. The girl asked me to warn her when I was gonna come, so I farted. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking what more of a warning do you girls need? You hear the funny noise, get the fuck out of Dodge. And she's all like, bleh, 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 bleh. And I'm like, I don't pay you to talk. <laughs> ah! Family though, what are you gonna do, huh? <laughs> I hear you. I'm not going to that reunion again, either. <laughs> Fuck you, Grandma. <laughs> and your delicious potato salad. <laughs> Maybe I'll tell you about myself. I grew up in a very strict household. I remember once my dad caught me and my younger brother smoking in the house. My dad decided to punish us. <laughs> Took us out in the backyard, pulled out one of those great big Cuban cigars. And then he made us suck his cock. <laughs> That's to say, I don't smoke anymore. No, but my brother does. <laughs> I'm joking! There was no cigar. <laughs> Just pop a cock. <laughs> you have a cell phone. Cell phone companies, they offer these different deals. I signed up for one of their deals, but what I ended up was with was with their fucked over deal. <laughs> to say my first bill wasn't what I expected, it was a lot more than I expected. The guy actually came to my house, four o'clock in the morning, huh? <laughs> it's okay. It's all right, go back to sleep. Yeah, I got your bill here for you. There you go. Oh, yes, it's your first bill, isn't it? I can tell. Yes, I can. Shh. Shh. I thought it was 50 bucks for 500 minutes. You went over, fuckface. You went over. Oh. Oh. I'll see you in a month. I'm never getting any sleep. I think sex is better when you're in love. Actually, I was making love the other day. <laughs> it could happen. All right, I haven't seen a vagina in so long, I've been jacking off to my own ass in the mirror. Yeah, I put lipstick on it so it's not so gay. <laughs> Every morning it's the same thing. Oh, I didn't see you come in. You're the boss, Tony Danza, you're the boss. <laughs> Get to say it was a little while ago and I was thinking to myself in the middle of this beautiful, beautiful expression of love, if she was to suddenly die, would I stop or not? 
I think at first they're going to be a little upset. <laughs> oh no, she's dead. Oh God, no, no. <laughs> I guess we're doing something different tonight. <laughs> oh, and you never need complaints from a corpse. Like, you're on my hair. I got a cramp in my leg. Get that gun out of my mouth. Blah, blah, blah. Women. <laughs> I love coming up to Montreal because I'm what you call a sucker for an accent. Drives me crazy. I was doing some shows a few weekends ago. After the show, I met this lovely, lovely young lady. We had a few drinks, ended up back at her place and uh, doing the deed, if you will. Next morning, I rolled over and I whispered her ear and I said, <gasps> say something to me in that crazy accent of yours. And she rolled over and she looked at me and she said, I'm like, what part of Toronto are you from? <laughs> huh? Ooh. And what's that? You want to do it again? Well, put your visor down on your helmet, sweetheart. Because daddy's going downtown. <laughs> That's right, I fucked a retarded girl. And I'll do it again. Come here, honey, daddy needs some loving. Don't bite my face, don't bite my face. <laughs> I didn't know. I thought she was hammered. Showing off in her wheelchair. <laughs> Another drink for the lady. We're still together. She'll never leave me. No, I took the wheels off her chair. <laughs> oh yeah, I know I'm going to hell for that one. But fuck it, it's gonna be warm and I'm gonna know people there. So whatever, Montreal. Jason Rouse, a nice young white fella. Yeah, the future of the world. This next guy, originally from New Jersey, he's a comedy outlaw. It's what I, Roddy Dangerfield said he was his favorite comic that was in a fucking magazine. I love him to death. Give it up for the very, very funny Otto and George. George. 